and I ain't got shit to do. Work. So this will be coming out before my next vlog, but I've got, pretty much got the saddle adjusted. I love the stopper knots with the tail on the back of each one, just in case I do need to make some fine tuning adjustments. I have uh, some to work with, but I haven't checked these yet. So before I actually climb, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Yeah, I'd say they're good. Feels so good. I was wanting to go higher, but this thing's getting worse by the foot. So I'm gonna go ahead and top it off here. And get my time point over there, just in case. All right, safe. <laughs> Oh my god, it feels so good. Unfortunately, I was incorrect about the Evo 2s. They are not so comfy for spur climbing. <laughs> this guy is trying to shot in between those two it'll probably hit that limb either break it off or get knocked off course I'm not really sure I don't think it'll get hung up though <laughs> This thing is on its way out. That right stem is the only one in any decent shape. And it's got some fungus on the other side of the trunk. And erosion dropped this one right into that one. And it itself is hanging on by a thread. It's coming down, barely standing. So I think I can get three for one, just take this one right into those two and knock them all down. <laughs> Amos right on just brushed off to the left. Oh well, I'm not fucking getting that thing.
title of this video doesn't really fit anymore. I initially planned on doing quite a bit more climbing. Yeah, as I mentioned, the uh, Evo 2 is not so great for spur climbing. You know, I thought they'd be a little more comfy than that over time, and I really wasn't up there all that long. But I still had fun. Had a lot of dead stuff down. But cold front moved through, and I'm quickly running out of daylight, so calling it. Have a good one, humans.